Now, the thing to remember about the 12 tribes of Israel is that they were 12 tribes. Now, I don't know about y'all's family, but we can barely get two people to agree on something, let alone 12. Well. <laughs> she is not wrong about that. But somehow, Moses got all the tribes of Egypt to agree to do this strange, bloody thing. To slaughter their firstborn lamb and to paint the doorways with its blood. And lo and behold, it worked. Yeah. They walked out of Egypt with their heads held high. Yeah. The sea itself parted out of respect for their unity of purpose. Amen. That's right. How did Moses do all of that? How did he do I never that? heard Moses used as a uniter in that way. Or was it Moses? Very on brand. It was God who did it. It was God who did it. Hallelujah. Catch this through Pharaoh. Every time Pharaoh gave an order, Every time he moved God's people this way and that against their will, he united them against a common enemy. That's good. And when they finally rose up, it cost Pharaoh his own son. Now, I want you to hear me right now. I want you to catch this part. Anyone out there in the world who thinks that they can get away with pushing God's people around. I have got news for you. God is using you to unite us. Amen. And woe to you when we rise. Woe to you when we rise. Rise up, church. Rise up, church. Trouble! Rise up, tell 